The River State Governor Similai Fubaro has charged clerics in the state to caution headsmen against harassing residents of communities and killing farmers and damaging corpses in the state. Fubaro gave the charge when he received the leadership of the Muslim community who paid a visit in the spirit of the Muslim festival of Eid al Adar. The report. The governor said his administration cannot be protecting their businesses while some errant members of their fold are destroying the businesses and livelihoods of others. He warned that if the attacks persist, the government will be compared to weld the full force of the law against the perpetrators. Praising Allah for the things he has done, and I believe that he will do more for you people. I want to thank you again for coming to also thank us for what we have done. We are a government that understand and feel the pulse of our people. We know that you are about celebrating your saga. And uh, it is important for people to eat. It is important for people to make merry. And that is why we had to surprise you people, to tell you that it is not only our own people, the Christians, that you also considered in what we are doing. So I want to assure you that I want to assure you that the same protection that we are giving to our people will still extend to you. Our belief and resolve as a state is for a better river state, not just for the indigents, but also for our visitors. Governor Fubera explained that the purpose of his administration is to protect the lives and property of everyone. In his address, the leader of the delegation and vice president, the general of River State Council of Islamic Affairs, Nasiru Awilebe Uho, vowed that the Muslim community will not be involved in using religion to destabilize the state while also pledging support for the policy and programs of the government of Governor Seminalai Fubara. Please, see how you can resolve this problem. The local governments are complaining. We don't want to take laws into our hands because we feel that uh, if we have to use all the necessary force, it might escalate and lead to uh, unrestiveness in most of those areas where you do your business. So I want to charge you people. And I think it will not be out of place if I expect a result in the next one week or two weeks from you. Call your people that are, do, that are doing the business of uh, men or whatever they call it, or cattle rearing, call them to order. They shouldn't be harassing our people. They shouldn't be killing innocent people in their farms. Please, I want your people to do something about it so that we don't get to a point where things will be out of hand. To show our sincere gratitude for what you have done for us Muslims, especially this season. It has not happened in the history of this state that for you to have made it possible for them to celebrate this with tons of rice is something they appreciate. And it did not come before after our visit. It came before our visit telling us that there is hope, where our confidence in you is rekindled, and our confidence in your administration is wide. We are, in turn, prepared to work with you, to work for you, and to do whatever thing is required of us to make this your tenure a success. Because <laughs> your the success of your administration translates to the wider success of the society and including with the Muslim community. The governor assured of keeping the channel of communication between it and the Muslim community open so stakeholders can enjoy the benefits of the prevailing peace to do their businesses and worship without molestation. 
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.